The reason why I'm here today is to find out if my man is cheating on me. I don't cheat on her, she cheat on me. I cheat on him because um, I want the truth. I love this man. That's all I want from him is the truth. So the only time that I cheat is to bring out the truth in him. I cheat to save my relationship. I don't just cheat with malice intent. She shows me sex videos that she made or her and the other male. I cheat, but that's only to make us closer. I make sex videos just to make us closer. And he don't understand that. He's not getting it, so I'm gonna make more until he tells me the truth. Other than the men that he knows about, the five men that he knows about, I've never cheated on him at all. I, I mean, I'm honest with you, so I don't understand why when I tell you that I'm cheating, you can't tell me when, you, when you're cheating. It's not gonna take my love away. It then got so bad to the point to where he put his personality inside the cat to where the cat doesn't even like me. And it, it started off being my cat. Then it ended up being his because he just took to the cat. And I mean, they have this exact same personalities. No matter where I go in that house, that cat is following me, stalking me. Oh my God, Steve, I'm here today because first of all, I want to let you know that I love my man. Like, I'm here to prove, like, I want him to prove to me his love. You know what I'm saying? But before he do that, I want to let you know you fine because I watch you all the time. <laughs> so, <laughs> you know. I go, you know, to the store, I come back, my door's locked. What, what is the door locked for? So some say, you hear that? I go, I say, put my ear to the door, you know, put it up there. Listen, I hear, you know, sounds of sex. So some say, look under the door, because we got this big space that you can What are to. sounds of sex? Uh, uh, uh -huh. that. <laughs> so I look under the door, I put my head under there, I go under there, I look, I say, did he doing his business? You had that say, much room under your door? Yeah, you so what I can see. What is y'all doing? So he finally opened the door. So I asked her first. She said, yeah, because no woman's going to lie on her body. I asked my man, this man went to blinking and thinking. And I didn't do that. I didn't have sex with that woman. This is how he do when he lies. I didn't do that. What, what, you believe I did that? <laughs> so what am I supposed to believe, Steve? So it's wrong to cheat. Oh, yeah, it's wrong to cheat. But yeah. then you cheat. I cheat to save my relationship. That's the only reason why I cheat. So I don't care what nobody think. So not only do you cheat, you videotape it. Yeah, I videotaped it, because you can see with your eyes and hear with your ears, then you should know. And then you send it to a key. Yeah, I send it to him. What's his reaction? <laughs> What's this about the cat? I didn't understand that. It's like, this cat is, is preying on me, because I heard him one day tell the cat, now you protect this house and don't let nobody in here. Now, my best friend come over. We have to separate the cat from her because the cat ring on reels trying to scratch him. the cat's listening to Yeah, him. the cat, let, no, the cat want to get them up out of there. They, right. He makes them uncomfortable enough to leave. So I can't even have company because of the cat and the man. <laughs> so when you cheat, you have to leave your house? No, I don't leave my house. I stay at home. He got to leave. You cheat with the guys in your house? Yeah, because he did it before. That's what started it. He did it once before in my house, so I wanted to and finish. And you caught him in your house? Yes, I did. I caught him, and he still lied about it. You caught him cheating, and he still denied it? Yes, he still denied it. You saw them, you know... Yes, Steve, I saw it. <laughs> that, I don't know what that means. That, that means. you know what it means, that. It means just that, Steve. We all know what that means. So where he at, then? <laughs> Hold up. Hold up, hold up. Well, okay, this way. Should we put little cat treats on right. and clear them up? We gonna go... He might need some catnip. <laughs> Wait, where you going? Where is you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Wait a minute, don't you... run. Don't run, because everywhere you run, I'm gonna find you. Everywhere you go, I'm gonna find you, so there's no reason for you to run from me, Aki. <laughs> Ain't no reason for it. I'm running for I the truth. That's you. all I'm running for. I'm running for you. I'm running for you, because you crazy. That's what you are. No, oh, I better be crazy. Oh. Well, come get the truth then, Aki. Ain't no reason for that. Okay, the key did come here and take a lie detector test, and he makes a confession right off the bat. A confession? What's that? What you confess to, it's baby? It's when somebody admits to the truth. Oh. Um, oh, so that's just... Okay, yeah, okay. okay. He confessed to having sexual contact and intercourse with one female, one, during the relationship with Constance. That's not bad. That's not bad, but I know no. about that one, right. so that don't even count. Okay. One time, hold on now, one time. And he still lied about it until we got here. Okay. Oh, yeah, one but time. Then, but then we went on to ask him, in June of 2018, 
that incident you were talking about. Did you have any type of sexual physical activity, contact or intercourse with that woman in your house? He answered no. Since together with Constance, besides one other female, have you had any other sexual physical contact with other females besides Constance? He answered no. Since together with Constance, besides one other female, have you had sexual intercourse with any other females besides Constance? He answered no. The results came back all the same to each question. It came back that a key told the truth. I'm sorry. I got a million dollar smile, man. I want to let you know I am so sorry. Me and I can't believe smile, this. man. Steve. <laughs> I was hurt. That's the only okay. reason why I did Can it. you stop cheating? Yeah, because I love him and I want to be with him for the rest of my life. I just want to give you all the gratitude for even allowing me to be a guest on the show. And what's up? Like, I mean, it is what it is. Like, I don't cheat no more. So. <laughs> So, so you, you leave the show and you're still with the key then? Yeah, I'm still with Aki. If I can't cheat with you, I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna <laughs> leave Aki. Uh, <laughs> you the man of my dreams, see? I know, but like, I, no, no offense to your wife. You know, I love her. Like, let's get that straight yeah. out. Of here. I love her. But Steve, you is just the finest cream to my coffee. You know what I'm saying? Like, we gonna put Aki out the picture. It's not about him right now. It's about me and you. And is uh, is the key there now? Oh, yeah, I keep right here. Like, he ain't never gonna go nowhere. Where you gonna go? <laughs> <You're so skinny. laughs> yeah. <laughs> How would you describe the relationship? Did you did you see her making uh, a different kind of effort? How are things? Oh, things been pretty good, Steve. Like, like we working on it, you know what I'm saying? And we yeah, look. it's getting better. It's getting way it's better. It's better, all done. And so you're like, he still be blinking and thinking, though. He still be doing that. I don't know if he lied or not, and, but and he so, still so be. <laughs> now, I'm, I'm, I'm hearing that you guys got engaged? Yes, we are, Steve. And I want to send a special invite to you when we go get married in Vegas. Vegas we're actually going to go get eloped. So I want you to walk me down the aisle, or we can FaceTime and you can be there. But you have the invite to walk me down the aisle, Steve. <laughs> You gonna do it or not? <laughs> First of all, I, me and my wife love going to Vegas. Like, we love that. But, oh, so that's perfect. Yeah, but I just want to warn you, the last time I went with a good friend of mine to Vegas and he got married, it didn't turn out so well. So I don't want to be a curse on your situation. Oh, Lord, no, Steve, no. <laughs> this is going to be different because you there. You know, you you the golden spoon, you know, so you're going to make our wedding <laughs> worthwhile. You saved our relationship. Spoon. So you have, no, you have no reason not to be there if you saved our relationship. Well, I'd, I'd love to come. I, both of us would. So uh, if we get the invite, we're, we're definitely going to try to make it. But, uh, cool, cool, you Steve. know, it's, it's, it, it is, to me, a little amazing that you guys made it through all that, right? Like, you guys went uh, through a lot, and, you know... I still can't stand him, but, you know, I, I'm with him. I still can't stand him, but I'm going to be with him. I'm going to stick beside him. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I mean, you do... He play too much. <laughs> yeah, you guys do love each he gonna other. He's going to pay for that one, Steve. Uh, listen, we're really happy that you guys, uh, you made it through that. Uh, you're in a good spot. You get married. Hopefully, we'll be able to attend it. Wish you all the luck, yeah. and hope, hopefully, we'll see you at the wedding then. You will, Steve. You got the personal invite. And like I said, Steve, I'm blessed to be one of your guests on your show. You like the realest person that I know. And keep up the good work. You know, we here for you to support you 100% with whatever you do with the rest of your life, Steve. Thank you. Well, I appreciate that. Thank you very much. Thank you. I was right. <laughs> My name is Steve Wilkos, and I'm an investigative talk show host with a law enforcement background. It was my life or his. My job is to get truth and justice for everyday people. Watch our videos now.